My name is Chrissy Lemaire. I'm a PowerShell MVP. Uh, I also work at NATO Special Ops Headquarters in Belgium. I'm actually a contractor there. I work for GDIT, with General Dynamics, um, and I am a SQL DBA, and my focus is SQL Server and PowerShell. I started using PowerShell uh, quite a long time ago, in about 2005. Uh, I went to the Professional Developers Conference in Los Angeles, and that's when I first saw Jeffrey uh, and Lee, and they did a presentation, and I was a big fan of Linux, and I was really excited about this new shell, but I actually didn't really get decently good at PowerShell until 2011. Uh, I think that my, my background with VBScript and T-SQL kind of held me back because it was so drastically different. And so it just took a very long time for me to kind of separate the two and understand the differences with PowerShell and how, how it works. Uh, primarily, I so I've done a lot with PowerShell, a lot of fun things. You can do, you work with Spotify, Last.fm, Cloudflare, but my primary focus is uh, working with SQL Server. There's so much, I have dbatools.io, and we have, there's so many fun commands within that. Uh, I really love SQL Server. I think that it's a fun platform to work with, and it's also super stable, which I love. And then PowerShell, to automate all the power of SQL Server uh, is, is primarily what I do, and, uh, and I really love it, it's exciting. It really, I use PowerShell to automate away all of the boring tasks that I have to do every day, so I don't have to, well, they're, they're just done for me. I can say this, whenever I, uh, I got my PowerShell MVP, I was so excited um, because I felt that of all the MVPs, that really covered so much, so many different things, right? So you could work in the cloud, you could work with SQL Server, you could work with Exchange. And so for me personally, feeling that way, I think it really conveys the importance to me as a technologist uh, of PowerShell and how it is the future. I know that there, uh, in the SQL Server community, there can be a, a bit of pushback, uh, but I believe that people really have to get on board with it. And hopefully, whenever they use PowerShell in the proper way, they see how fun and relaxing it is because it's just doing everything for you. Um, and so hopefully there'll be a greater adoption because ultimately PowerShell is probably the most important skill set uh, that a technologist can have today. I was actually really excited to see uh, Will Schroeder's pre-con because I, I kind of dabble in InfoSec and, but I'm not like, I'm just kind of a hobbyist. And what I didn't understand are all of the different things that are out there for PowerShell. And so I really loved his, uh, his presentation because it gave a really good overview of what the, the blue team does, what the red team does, and all of the tools um, that have developed. And not only that, I really like the history of you know, what was going on. So it started in 2010 and then how it's grown over the years to 2017. This is, in my opinion, the best conference that I have ever been to. And I think that it's because Tobias really emphasizes, uh, com like, well, not just community, but getting along. So last year, there was a thing that said uh, during the opener, um, we're all here to have a great time together. And so it feels like a very together thing. Like we aren't, you know, like it's not a bunch of people like trying to show off stuff. It's everybody coming together and solving problems excitedly with one another.